scary my customers are like. Good day. People! The shit. mutant's pursuing me! <laughs> we should send for Laredo. Want to stir it? I don't stir. Give a shit about your guild. I'll not join that racket nor change my prices. My weapons are superior, and that's how I aim to keep it. Shame. Please think it over. The guild helps and protects, and accidents do happen. Fires are common enough in smithies, and a broken arm can make it very difficult to forge weapons. You threaten me, dipshit. Piss off. And don't come back, or I'll thrash you so hard, even your plowing guild won't help you! Hey boss, look who's graced our smithy. That titan of the art of smithing can't hear us. Busy, works a blur in his hands. And how are you, witcher? Things working out for you? 
Nice workshop. Bah, it's no workshop, just a simple forge. But thanks for the compliment, both in my name and the master's. So how can we help you, eh? So, 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 how can we help you, eh? Ha! Greetings. A word, if you will. You see, we've created an alchemical substance and we wish to test it in Vizima, in a laboratory. Seeing as you're a witcher, we wondered if you'd be willing to test it in practice. In a year or two, given the occasion, you could visit us in Vizima. We'd examine you and reward you generously. We need to study its long-term effects. We can't say more. Are you in? Why not? Splendid! Excellent! Now, if you could also keep a journal of the experiment. Don't overdo it. Greetings. Mind if I take a look at what you have in stock? Certainly. You're welcome to. I'm Fioranti, a merchant. Not to be nosy, but weren't you hired to kill the Kairan? I've had my fill of this place, and I'll be glad when the blockade is finally lifted. The Rita won't let you traders out until it suits him. Seems he needs you here for some reason. What's that supposed to mean, damn it? 
Is he organizing some international trade fair? I'm a subject of King Demavend, and I tell you... Demavend's dead. Ah. Uh. Now, if you don't mind, can we get down to business? And how do you find Kajun? Was it worth it? The White Wolf himself. Busy. Come back after dusk. New shoes. What happened? Hmm? I'm a witcher. Ha ya! I guess the cry. Oh! <laughs> 
for stars reflected in a pond. Want to play soldiers and squirrels? Ah, oh, welcome! Just some squirrels. Well, well, I had an inkling and it didn't disappoint me. It was a long voyage to this cesspit, but it's about to make sense. Voltest's killer, live and in person. How are you? Happy and healthy? Can't complain. I am delighted, really. But you see, it's a long way back to Vesima, and I'd rather not dawdle. I lost a load of time looking for you. No reason to waste any more talking, then. Bon voyage. Listen, Jester, you're worth more to me alive, but if need be, I will take you back as a corpse. You choose. All right, give it a shot. Drop your sword and put your hands together, or I'll not vouch for what... Shut up. Go ahead, try to kill me. Ah! We've got a wanted man here. A fine mess you have here. Dwarves hmm. stealing bread from the mouths of honest craftsmen. God bless you. Elves wandering among decent folk. Mutant. I'm born stiff. Welcome. What? Smart ass, eh? Good, good, good day. Welcome. Welcome. Just don't start any brawls. Peace and quiet. Get it? Of course. I've got my eye on you.
geil.
Do my eyes deceive me, or are you Witcher Geralt? What can I do for you? My cousin from Vizima claims you're good at dance. I can play. If the word gets out that you're a good contender, better players are likely to show up. The stakes will rise. Maybe even I'm a dancer or a sender of the dance. They're real masters. So, will you play? Sure. Great. We only play for fun, but Zindrab fancies himself a master. I won't play any old challenger. Show us what you can do, and who knows, I might sit down with you. You win. Care to roll some dice? I want a chance to win my coin back. Punches lights out! Superior players will sit down to games with you now. Though we'll so gladly play you again. What do you want? Care for a game of dice? Shall we roll a few rounds? You won. Care for a rematch? No. Try Einar Gorzel from the Craftsman's District. Beat him and who knows? Maybe even Sendler will agree to play you. Thanks. Hunt 
just lights out! <laughs> Forgive us. Distance oh. is an insult to the gods. I can make no sense of this relic I have been entrusted with. The gods have not granted me understanding of it. Perhaps Providence grants you luck. And then I shall give you this prize. Perhaps you will make better use of it. It does not look as though Providence has given you favors. I shall carry this relic for now. Does not look as though You are lucky, traveler, but not enough. It does not look as though the gods decree that you should bear up my burden. We have seen for... I can make no sense of this relic I have been entrusted with. The gods have not granted me understanding. You are lucky, traveler. Only the gods. Wait till it drops, yeah. the fucking god! What's going on here? A competition, brother. With the port closed, we're bored off our asses. Care to take part? What are the rules? The contenders put their coin down. Winner takes all. The fighting rules. Drop your opponent and make sure he stays down. Complicated. So? Are you fighting, brother? Oh, yeah. He's a fresher like you, brother. Good for starters. Put your coin down. So, what'll it be? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin! Left hook! Watch out for the left hook! That was fucking poetry! Up for another, brother. Who's up next? Cor Bransel, known as Flippass. Strange name. Does everything backwards, sleeps in daytime, drinks before he eats, and tells women to get dressed before he plows them. Flippass. 
Show us your orange. So what'll it be? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin. Hey, champ! What? I can tell you're a serious contender. Far too good for this drunken riffraff. Believe you me, I know what I'm talking about. So? I don't know you. They call me King Ziggy, because I pay like a king. If you want a taste of fame and riches, look for me by the inn in the evenings. I'll take you to the right place. Wouldn't want to get on your bad side. Up for another, brother. Who's up next? I knew you'd end up fighting each other. Who's that? Tidy Tim. The bastard eats honey straight from the hive, drinks for four, and some say he can hang a bucket full of water from his cock. You better get a solid coin pouch ready. So what'll it be? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin. Left hook, watch out for the left hook. Left hook. What, what that was fucking poetry. Congratulations. You dropped some of the toughest brawlers. Well done. Tournament's over. Gobble up. <laughs> Just lights up! Fucking grief, they'll soon pay you back. King Ziggy ain't no thief. Who does King Ziggy behold? Given any thought to my proposal? Give me the details. Only once you've made your mind up, my friend. For now, you'll have to make do with the lure of fame and coin. Or you can go on wasting your talents beating the dust out of drunkards around the inns. What do you say? I'm ready. I'll explain on the way. What's going on there? Oh. 
Know what Flotsam's famous for? Nothing. You're wrong there. There are only two towns worth visiting in the Pontar Valley. Bondar, famous for having the most beautiful hordes in the north, and Flotsam for having the best fist fight in sea. Who organises these fights? Officially, no one. But look hard and you'll be surprised what you can find. It's a vibrant scene with winners and losers of all kinds. I promote fighters, place them in tournaments, singled you out and venture to say you're not repelled. Halt! Don't recognise King Ziggy? I know you, but who's the other one? He looks dangerous. Like all of King Ziggy's fighters. Well, that farmhand you brought in last time was carried out all broken in no time. This one will be different. You'll see. The Commandant himself will bet a fortune on him. All right. But if I'm to let him in, he has to leave all his weapons here. Fine. You're a rich man already. The weapons will be waiting in the trunk outside the gate. In the flesh. Does he condone these fights? Condone? He sets them up. A lot of coin at stake here. I haven't been too lucky lately, but I believe you'll change that. People will remember King Ziggy. Just don't disappoint me. Finish the fucker off! Ziggy the Clown returns. And in grand fashion. I've got a contender who's about to be famous. The Monster Slayer? How'd you talk him into fighting? King Ziggy has his ways. All in all, looks promising. We're about to make Flotsam famous for its mug fights. They'll sing songs about Ziggy and Geralt. You just win and I'll take care of the rest. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Grand. I'll hear you say my name with reverence yet. Twigs will be your first opponent. So cool because bones snap with his every punch. I love these pussies with cocky names. Sock it to him! Stand your ground! Finish the fucker off! Beautiful job rearranging his face. Who's next? One Punch Matho. Name says it all. Downs most opponents with his first punch. I'll see if I can't make him throw a second. Good luck. Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Sock it to him! You're the discovery of my lifetime. Think we're made for each other? Indeed. But we've a long way to go. Your next opponent is Smugface, also known as Tassel Dick. Not too popular then. He has tassels on his clothes. Last month, he bit his opponent's ear off. Bring on this Tassel Dick. 
Finish the fucker off! Stand your ground! Finish the fucker off! One more and we'll be rich and famous. Who is it? Stanek. In a rumble it takes at least four lads to take him down. I'll do it single-handed. Don't underestimate him. Witcher, come here a minute. It's impressive technique. Thanks. Last fight's coming up. And everyone's betting on the dead cert. You. Except for me. What do you want, Lurido? Stenek has to win. But the true winners will be you and me. A third of the jackpot's yours. And that's not an offer. I see. You're a regular Khan. Your opinions don't interest me. You ought to take a dive. That's that. Piss off, old man. Finish the fucker off! Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Pay up. Here's your coin. The guards will take you to the gate. You'll regret this. I told you we'd win. I've got a real sense for these things. I think you owe me something. Why don't we have some fun first? A free round at every inn, not to mention the girls. You can screw my share. I tell him, I'm taking your pouch. And your life. What did he say? He said, ha! there's a third option. Then his hand inched towards his knife. Welcome.
Greetings. What brings you here, White Wolf? Make yourself at home, please. Do we know each other? I've heard, or rather read much about you, in the letters of the Rivian Diaspora. Well, nice to meet you. Einar Gausel. Fundamentally a trader in old curios, although I also concern myself with a non-human community. Books in Flotsam? I wouldn't have thought it a profitable enterprise. Hey, many foreigners come through here. Sometimes they buy books, sometimes they have tomes to sell. Yesterday, for example, Lady Sheila de Tansevo purchased items for a sum equal to my yearly dealings. Did she buy anything interesting? De Vermis Mysteries, the Exeter Treaties, complete and unabridged, plus a very expensive volume I'd rather not mention. I should add, as generosity must be praised, that she made a donation to the community, specifically to the Fund for Widows and Orphans. The non-humans in Flotsam are organised? We aren't, but we aid each other as best we can. I mainly collect taxes and announce the Commandant's dispositions. That'd make you a prime target for Yorveth. <laughs> You're correct on that account. He's warned me many times, and I've explained the need for my function to him just as many. Both in vain. It seems we've agreed to disagree. Well, the sword is his calling, the pen is mine. Hence, no meeting of the minds. It wasn't always this hard. Turned sour when several elven lassies disappeared. We lost our trust in the humans and the Scoia'tael ceased trusting us. Did they turn up, the women? No, I believe Necker's killed them. I remember Moral of the White Hands. She and her lover made a beautiful pair.
Mind if I have a look at your books? Take your time. No hurry. Mind if I have a look at your books? Take your time. No hurry. What do you want to prove with those swords? The gods have no love for your kind. Mind if I have a look at your books? Take your time. No hurry. I want to play dice. All right. Shall we? I'm lost! Hand over the coin. Here, but I'll not play you anymore. So, who is up for a game around here? Sandler's the best. We'll see. Want you to see a vista, eh? Excellent work. In it? The finest hides and the tannins on half by either. A straggler, yeah? A lobber there? Sometimes a hapless calf. I've even got otter fur for you. You hunt? Oh, we must not hunt in the royal forest. Even children know that. Besides, it's too dangerous to go among the trees now. What with all those monsters? They must be finding more food in the area. A war's brewing, methinks. Not necessarily. The Scoyatel attack merchants and ambush patrols. Ideal conditions for necrophages. We ought to wait for better times and be satisfied with the little things, like the good book teaches us. I'd like to play dice. Shall we play now?
you're just not good enough for Sendler. Come back and see me if you want to lose more coin. Oh, I will. I'd like to play dice. Shall we play now? Good. Here's your coin. I heard you deal in traps. Indeed. Though that's not all I deal in. I don't want coin. I want something else. Suit yourself. Choose. I could use a design for a nitroglycerin trap. A what? You know. The kind that pretty much vaporizes anything that steps in it? Ah, the puff banger. The design's yours. <laughs> 